healthcare workers fight the coronavirus, the state of Texas needs more nurses. And a new facility at Concordia University is helping to get them ready. Tori Larnett is live for us this morning. And Tori, this new facility is much needed for future nurses. Yeah, Vaughn, right now there just aren't enough nurses. And Texas ranks second nationally and when it comes to a shortage of nurses here in the U.S. Now, this is according to the National Center for Health Workforce Analysis. Concordia University, Texas, though, hopes this brand new facility is going to help fix that. This $1 million, 16,000 square foot facility finished in about a year and a half. It's part of a satellite campus that already existed over near the Arboretum, and it features things like new technology and simulation labs with lifelike patients. While it did open this past fall, the university did have to make changes to deal with the COVID pandemic. Program leaders turned much of their planned spaces into socially distanced areas for nurses to practice, and they even added COVID-19 to their curriculum. I'd say it's really important for our community. I know that we've obviously been hit really hard with some of the limitations with COVID and the more prepared right now we can get our nursing students to go into practice and really bridge that transition is really important. More than 400 students are in this nursing program right now. Now, Dr. Amber Shamas, who you just heard, heard from with Concordia, says Central Texas will need about 2,500 nurses by 2022 as the population grows and many older nurses retire. So if you're interested in becoming a nurse and want to check out this brand new facility, they say they're going to have a virtual grand opening on February 9th. We'll have the details about how you can watch that on KVU.com. Yvonne. All right, that sounds good. Thank you so much, Tori.